Hello everyone, my name is Daniel and welcome to episode 10 of our devlog series. Over the last week we've actually mostly been focusing on some inventory, just fixing up some bugs and adding the last remaining features until it's completely done. Hopefully next week we just have a couple more bugs remaining with the AI and the inventory and then we're going to have some special news coming up in the next couple weeks. On Tuesday, I've actually started on loot bags. I actually started this a little earlier than Tuesday. You actually saw in the, the last devlog just a small clip, but I actually couldn't get it to work, so I kind of just left it off until this devlog. But we got loot bags basically in, but we did have a couple more bugs we wanted to fix on later this week, and we actually fixed those on Saturday. Wednesday I didn't have too much time to work but I did get as much as I could when I got home from doing my stuff. I redid the back end to the inventory. I made drag and drop not focus on the item slots itself but actually you drag a dragged slot instead of each item slot. So it's a little confusing to explain but overall it just made the inventory work way better and it would allow for splitting of stacks later on. In the future I also created item sacks uh, which is kind of a continuation from Tuesday. I really just continued on that whole system and just slowly got it all finished up. The next day that I actually worked on the game was on Saturday. I completely finished up the item sacks and this was actually completely done on stream. I made these things called work ends where instead of streaming mid week and only streaming for about an hour, I would actually stream for a longer duration of time on Saturdays. So I think this stream was a little bit over an hour just so I can get slowly settled into streaming for a longer amount of time so I wouldn't get so burnt out. But we finished up item sacks completely and we also removed dual wielding which is really sad in my opinion. I've always wanted dual wielding in the game but as the game moves further and further and I've not really focused on dual wield combat as much as I have sword and shield combat I didn't want this game to be half baked with a half baked combat system in it so we just decided to stick with sword and shield and get that completely set in stone and just feeling really really good <laughs> For our second work end on Sunday, I wanted to finish up the second task I set for the first ever work end. I added the feature that allows you to equip a weapon and a show up on the player. This should have been done way earlier, but I kind of procrastinated and never done it. But now we got into the game. The other task I did was actually separate the sword and the shield slots into separate slots. Now you can customize each part of the sword and the shield weapon type. So before you couldn't really add a sword into a sword slot and a shield, they would actually be together in one slot so it would give the player less customizability but now with this feature we can actually give the player the ability to customize which sword and which shield they want to use in their playthrough. The last day of development was on a Monday this week. I wanted to finally start getting the basics of the game finalized and get a move on with other features. So I spent most of the day getting the team caught up to speed and just setting deadlines and overall just doing some house cleaning. Development wise, I actually spent the day doing some minor bug fixes and just overall small adjustments. So nothing really major happened on Monday, but this will definitely impact the future of the development. That's all I really have for this week. Thank you guys for watching and if you did enjoy hit that like button and subscribe. It really helps the YouTube channel grow and just in general brings more people into the community. Also we do have a Patreon if anyone is interested in supporting the game monetarily. It really helps out with just getting new features into the game and just shows the devs that you guys are really interested in the project and you would want to support it financially. Anyways thank you guys for watching everything and I'll see you guys next week. <laughs>